Hi everyone, let's begin. Pollution and cartels. What is the difference between pollution and cartels? We have already finished determinants and how we can decide price and output in oligopoly market. This is also one of the very important feature of oligopoly market. Pollution implies an agreement among firms about prices, output, market areas, use and construction of productive capacity, etc. So collision when we are collectively we are making an agreement on the various issues like prices output market areas use and construction of the productive capacity etc when such an agreement is reached openly and formally the group is called a cartel when this agreement is openly and it is a formal document and that is this agreement, everybody knows, okay, fine, this is the agreement and we are bound to this agreement. So, the group is called a cartel. If and on the, on, the, on the contrary side, we can say informal agreement is reached, it is collision. So, we can understand what is collision and what is cartel. So, when it is formal, then it is known as collision. And when it is informal agreement, then it is known as, this one is reached its collision, that is collision. And when it is formal, that is known as cartel. And here is, in order to avoid uncertainty arising out of interdependence, price wars and cutthroat competition, and they want to improve profits by stabilizing market share and prices firms Working under oligopolistic conditions often enter into agreement regarding a uniform price output policy to be pursued by them. But what are those conditions? Conditions are a small number of sellers, easy to enforce agreement. Like in oligopoly market, we had already studied. There are few sellers and large number of buyers. Similar cost conditions. Similar cost conditions means I am in both these companies, they are facing similar cost conditions. Minimal product differentiation. I mean, very, they are very close to each other. Very minimum characteristics are differentiated. So, minimal product differentiation. And high entry barriers. High entry barriers means it is not easy to enter into the market. This is very difficult. That is the restriction. And only those companies get the license, they can enter into the market. So, this is the difference between collision and cartel. Cartel means formal and collision means informal. Then we come to the price, how we can decide price in a cartel. So, under this form of association, a central admin, ad, admin and control body is established by all the member firms called a cartel. That means there is a centralized governing body. That is, we can call it central admin and control body that is established by all the member firms that is known as cartel. That is known as cartel. The cartel determines the quantity of production. I mean, how many, how many units we are going to produce. Price for all the member firms. Price is determined at the point at which MR equal to MC. When is price we are going to decide? When market revenue, this one is the sorry, marginal revenue is equal to marginal cost for entire industry. And at this point, total profit of the industry will be maximum. So, at this point, total profit of this industry will be maximum. Since the cartel's price is always higher than the average cost of the least efficient member, all firms in the cartel make profits, but the lower cost firms will make more profit than the higher cost firm. Obviously, because let's say this admin firm that is the centralized governing body, they have decided Whatever is the price they have decided and all the firms follow the this price. But those firms having low cost production, obviously they are getting more margins, more profit. But those are operating at the higher cost, they are getting less margins because price is same 
for every firm. Those are part of the cartel. So this is the um, this is the difference between collision and cartel. So I hope this video is clear to you, difference between collision and cartel. And we will discuss some more issues in our next video. Thank you. Stay tuned. Keep watching.